It is February 7th, 2023, and today I figured I would go to a modern storyline that's been going on. I've been doing some past matches lately, like yesterday I did Hogan and Andre against Bundy and Stud from Saturday Night's Main Event back in 1985. Today I was watching Raw last night and figured I would uh, do something, they had a the contract issue with uh, Brock and Bobby Lashley. So I figured I would have the match because they're fighting at the 2023 Elimination Chamber on February 18th. So I, that's where I got the idea from. I figured I would do something current today. And last night, if you saw Raw last night, uh, Brock had the contract. He wanted Lashley to sign it. And Lashley had to check with his lawyer and his manager and stuff like that. So, it looks like the match is going to happen, though. Because uh, whenever there's a contract, there's, the match always ends up happening. Even if they say they're going to check with somebody or whatever. So, I, I chose the Elimination Chamber Arena in WWE 2K22 here. Just to keep it on uh, the, the accuracy of the, where the match is going to happen. I wonder if they're going to have a rematch at WrestleMania. Because they're fighting at the Elimination Chamber, it looks like, as of right now. So, it's... Uh, like I said, it's Tuesday, February 7th, so as of this date, we're 11 days out from the pay-per-view, or the live event, premium live event, whatever they call it now. But I think you can still order the pay-per-views if you don't have uh, the WWE Network or Peacock, whatever you want to call it. I liked it better when it was just the WWE Network before it was on Peacock. It was just a better uh, situation. I don't know, some people might like it better on Peacock. Of course, with Peacock, you get all the movies and stuff and everything, TV shows, too, additionally to the WWE stuff. But the uh, WWE Network was just all wrestling, and I, I like that better. So we got Brock here uh, working over Lashley's arm, it looks like. See, also, Edge started the show on Raw last night with uh, Beth Phoenix. They're going to have a tag team match there. And then uh, at the end, they had the uh, the cage match at the end where Lita surprised everybody at the end. And then they had a great segment with uh, Cody Rhodes and Paul Heyman. Getting, uh, we're talking about Dusty Rhodes' father and uh, the the uh, getting ready for the WrestleMania. Roman Reigns, Cody Rhodes' main event at WrestleMania. Unless Sami Zayn gets involved, we'll see what happens. Like Roman Reigns is fighting Sami Zayn at Elimination Chamber. We'll, we'll see what happens with all that. What I like to see is, I like to see Cody Rhodes versus Roman Reigns one-on-one, -on -one, and Cody Rhodes win the title at WrestleMania 39, but we'll see what happens. If uh, they do a triple threat, I'm not a big fan of the triple threats. I mean, they're, they're fun, but I like, I like for a main event at WrestleMania for the world title, I want a one-on-one -on -one match. I don't know, some people may want like different things. I'd also like to see a, I've never seen a Fatal 8-way. You can do that in WWE 2K22. I've never seen actual like a main event of a pay-per-view would be a fatal eight-way. I've seen the four-ways, but not the eight-ways. Let's see, Lashley's going for the... Oh, he's punching him here. I thought he was going to go for the cover. Let's see, he's more worn down here. We got Brock a little more worn down than Lashley. As we're about four minutes into this match. But this should be good. These two both have MMA experience, Lashley and Brock, so they, they should have a good match at Elimination Chamber. Looking forward to that. I, th I think uh, I don't know who's gonna who's gonna win. I don't know that match. I think maybe uh, Lashley will win because Brock's yeah he's Brock always disappears and comes back and disappears. So I think Lashley might win at the Chamber. We'll see what happens. But it's probably gonna set up something for WrestleMania. Man, I don't know if they're gonna have a rematch at WrestleMania. But I mean they they fought before. Let's see let's see what's gonna happen with all that. But. It should be fun. I'm looking forward to the chamber. I see Brock got it. Oh, he kicked out. So we'll see, we had, uh, maybe they're going to have a like a regular match at uh, the chamber, and then they'll have like a Hell in a Cell or some kind of cage match or something at WrestleMania to, just to make it more uh, interesting. They'll have something happen at the chamber and have a rematch. We'll see what happens. 
So maybe, t maybe tomorrow I'll go back to a, more cl a classic feud, but I, I want to do something. After watching Raw last night, I just want to do something modern today with the Lashley and Brock. Maybe I'll do Edge and Finn Balor or something tomorrow. Although if I want to stay more uh, topical. But I was looking at some of the old uh, WWF house shows from the 80s, looking for matches to do on, on the WWE Network. It's a lot, a lot of... Good. I love the uh, all the house shows on there that they had. Those were those were good shows. Those were good as any pay-per-view. I, I, I think they were they were a lot of good wrestling matches. If you just like pure wrestling, just the actual act of the wrestling, and you just want real good pure wrestling matches, the house shows were good for that. Let's see, Lash has got a submission. This is a pin-only match, so I like to use the submissions as wear downs. So who who enjoyed Raw last night? And see the the uh, NXT's on tonight, and and uh, the MLW Major League Wrestling is on uh, the the Reels channel if you have that tonight at, at 10 Eastern, 7 Pacific. It's a new new wrestling show. There's just a ton of wrestling on during the week now. You know, with Raw Monday, you got MLW and NXT on Tuesday, AEW Wednesday. Thursday, you got New Japan's on after uh, Impact Wrestling and SmackDown and, and Rampage on Friday. Just tons. Let's see if this ends it. Nope. And then uh, if there's probably more. I can't even think. There's probably more stuff. Plus, if there's a pay-per-view on the weekend, and then there's just if there's nothing on, you can always put the network on. And and the network's uh, cheap, cheap. You can pay five and watch the with ads, and you just pay five a month for it. It's not bad for all all the wrestling you get plus the pay-per-views. But there's some, some, because I think the pay-per-views are still, uh, if you order from cable, I think there's still like 50 or so, 40 or 50. I'm not sure. I haven't looked. All right, so this match, Lashley's red body and arms are all red. Look at that. He's, you know, Brock's uh, head's getting a little beaten up in arms. I always look at the body damage thing in the, at the bottom of the screen see how beat up they are. Lashley got him now. Oh, it is this is submission. Okay. So Lashley wins. Alright, I hope you enjoyed that and I'll see you tomorrow. Bye bye.